Let's do Lulzul. It's time for a round of Lulzul. I'm gonna press Classic. And I'm gonna try my best to make you all proud. I'm gonna guess Lee Sin. What? What? Woohoo! Easiest guess of my life! You guys see this? No way! I only put in Lee because I just played him last game. What? Whoa! -hoo -hoo. <laughs> Let's go to the quote. Is that the taste of salt on the wind? Ah, hello, brother. That's someone with a brother speaking of wind. It's Yone Ayasu. <laughs> yes! Yes! Okay, okay. That's the Laoi. It's the Laoi uh, 10 second stuff. Man, I might. Wait, bonus question. What spell is it? It's passive, I think. Wait. I don't even know if passives are included in this quiz. Oh no. Oh no. No, I'm gonna guess this wrong. Let me think. I don't think it's the W. I don't think it's passive because I've I've never seen a passive in this in this thing. I don't think it's W. So there's Q, E, and R left. Probably the E, because the E is when you like pull their soul, and the tentacle starts spawning. What? No way! It's the passive. No, but I've never seen a single passive mentioned. My confidence is ruined. It's over. Ah, oh, this is this is Maokai. Imagine if I if I had guessed the Lawi, I would have gotten every single one on first try, every single one. I think our jungle is on full mute. Full mute. Whenever I play with him and try to ping talk, he ignores. <laughs> the player would type that. Every single Soliku game I see him, he's like extremely negative. And now he's wondering why <laughs> why I usually mute him and don't listen to his pings. <laughs> I wonder why. This could be interesting, actually, because I can see what they're typing, but they all think I've muted both their pings and the chat. They're probably gonna trash talk me at some point without knowing we're gonna see everything. We are very sneaky. You need to watch the end of the interview? Okay, we're gonna finish the interview after this, don't worry. It was actually a long interview, the video was more than 10 minutes. But uh, we'll finish it right after this game. Ouchie. This is why I normally play with Shadow. Also worth pointing out that literally within a second of Ash dying, her instincts told her to spam ping Lulu and flame the crap out of her. Like, <laughs> legit. Instantly. This Ash tells herself that 
it has to be the support's fault and the support deserves to be flamed even though I can promise you <laughs> there's a lot of things Ash could have done to avoid dying a bot lane is not going to have an easy time enemy AD carry is upset so I'm sure he's going to do work on the Caitlyn he's also a really good Caitlyn player I mean in general upset is just a beast right but yeah These guys are kind of dying to a lot of so ganks. Okay, Ash, Ooh, you're gonna flame. That was Lulu's fault again, I'm sure. Of course it was. Maybe mid angle. Yep, that works. I'll go get my crocs and base. I need to farm a lot so I can become strong enough to carry. The bot lane department. <laughs> if Lulu comes with me, maybe we can catch Sinso. I am trying to ping you to join me, Lulu. I guess you don't want to. Uh, well, I knew he was here, but yeah. Maybe I shouldn't have gone in at all. Oh, we're going. He has flash. Why didn't he flash? I'm very confused right now. This is really awkward. Like what? There's so many things here that makes no sense to me. But ultimately... I can say whatever I want, none of it is going to change anything and I don't want to sink down to Ash's level of dying and just spamming everyone, blaming everyone. Yeah, that's what Oriana is doing. <laughs> Ash would be proud. <laughs> this Oriana is actually delusional. It's like seeing a silver player type right now. The only reason that I am not winning every game, that I am not diamond, is that my team is always so bad. They are always holding me back. I am always winning lane, always doing well. I'm a god. But the team, it's the team's problem. It's the team's fault, guys. It's always the team. And then this Oriana, by the way, was wondering at the start of the game why I usually mute him. Oh, hello there, friend. This might be a bit too greedy. I can't all in, I'll die. Caitlyn is Gale Force. Meanwhile, Ash has a couple of long swords. Fighting his heart. Maybe I can look mince myself here. Oh. A bit of work on the mid here. Or maybe we can flank bots. This could be a good play. I died. I am on my way, friends. Could have gone for Sinza, but just wanted to make sure Caitlyn died. She has a big bounty. Maybe we can look for her. She doesn't have flash now. Neither do I, though. We'll have a try. No Q, no shield. I need to land my W. Got it. Perfect. I looked up and then I base with Kragen. He knows. As a world smart. There's a pretty high chance we don't get this dragon. That bot lane is so much stronger than ours. Hilao is smashing Shen, all that good stuff. But maybe if we keep buying time, we'll find a couple of comeback plays here and there, and then, then I can carry. Because I am having a decent lead on Sinsa already. It should back. It's not gonna work out. Guys, we really shouldn't contest that. Guys? Oriana thinks it's my fault? That's cute. 
we are <laughs> She shouldn't be that old. It was a really big mistake to try to fight. You can't make that up, my account has to be cursed. And I almost feel bad for this guy. Like obviously he's very frustrated that he's losing every game, but the problem is that he doesn't realize that he's not playing well. He thinks he's flawless and he thinks it's all the team, so he's never gonna improve, it's never gonna get better. I'll try. Ilawi is really hard to gank, but I think it's my best chance. Got him. Why do you never smite cams mid late? It's rarely worth to use smite on cams in the later stages of the game just because it's only gonna buy me like a second of time and if I hold on to it and have it for a fight it can actually make a big difference. I might be able to do something mid here. Shen ult is almost up. He's CP flanking. That works as well I guess. We need to get Caitlyn though. Good here, I think. Yeah, we get it too. Huge! That was nice. They got too greedy. If we kill Caitlyn immediately, they're gonna lack damage and we win fights. This was a more or less perfect one because we had double flank, so she couldn't really do anything. Need to see if we can repeat it. I'm looking at Kate again. Need to kill Mr. Upset. I don't think they know about me. He's alone. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, come on. Get in there, friends. It's a dead Caitlyn. This is what I need to keep doing. Finding the flanks. Huge. I'll take that bot side and Drake. My lead on since I was growing. Uh, not sure if I can get Ash out of this one. Not sure if I can get myself out. Not the greatest. Kinda sucks if this hits our in hip tower. I think it will though. I can't prevent it. Expect me to cross map here. She shouldn't have vision either. Oh, she does the vision now. Caitlin might want our reds. Sorry, Mr. Offset. Pretty sure this red is mine. Greedy boy. Shinsons. There it is. <laughs> Let's go. They're gonna try to kill me, but we saw Caitlyn moving. I need to be really careful right now. I'm okay, I think. They should just stay mid. We're getting a tier 3 because these guys are 4 people trying to stop me. 
They should not fight right now, it's really troll to fight without me. Just get out. This is good if they live. They're basically doing what I just did, bringing air on top while I push bot. No, oh, now they're turning and fighting. Yeah, this is where they make a mistake. It was good until they thought they could win 4v5, then it was not very good anymore. Unfortunate. Still need to pop my elixir, but I haven't, haven't really needed it yet. I'll get a stopwatch. Might come in handy soon. I'm so close, level 16 as well. The highest on that team is level 13. I am really monstrous. My blue form is running out now. Okay, the form won't be running out after all. I can take this. Perfect. Let's keep going. I think Caitlyn is down here somewhere. Oh, she's gone. Lovely. And there we go. Another three minutes of true form. Caitlyn bot. That's a bit greedy, sir. You might end up regretting this. I have pinged them to back off. If they die, it's on them. We already got the two inhibs, there's nothing to fight for in their base. Meanwhile, here, I can actually get another turret. All of a sudden, we're getting really far ahead because we're taking all the objectives. surrendered. GG. Victory. Now everybody, <laughs> that was a learning lesson for all of us. If you have obnoxious teammates that give up to start flaming, that are being negative, this is how you approach it. I'm going to honor Lulu because Ash was hard flaming poor Lulu. Typing to them is not going to help anything. Typing back, tilting them more, it won't help. I ignored everything they said, played my game, stick to my game plan, and we did it. We made it happen. We got to see a beautiful, beautiful victory screen. Look how fit I was, by the way. I had 16.8k, second highest was upset at 12.6. 4.2k gold lead on their strongest champion. Holy moly.